we can show the community that poets matter, that art matters, that we can give back to the community. And it's like, um, oh, I cannot remember the artist's name. Uh, Rene Picard said it, you know, when he was helping Jean-Michel Basquiat. Art is not a scam. And this is proof, what we're doing, it is proof that we can do it and that we can inspire people to be better tomorrow than what they were yesterday and to let them know that it's all right. It's all right to be scared. It's all right to be angry. It's all right to feel everything. But you can always make better choices. You can always choose a different outlet. And for me, that's what poetry has always been. It's been a positive outlet and it's, it just makes me feel like I got something in my blood and in my veins and I just gotta get it out. And I, you know, like I said, I, I think it's the best time. Poetry is on a, is about to explode and I wanna help that. I wanna help make it global as what you're doing. You're all over the place, man. You're one of the, you're the hardest working man in poetry. I'm always on, you know, when I'm on Facebook, Mike wins here, Mike wins there. You're supporting everybody, you're behind them. And that is amazing, and more people need to look at that as an example about helping out your fellow community, your fellow artists, regardless if it's a poet or a painter or a photographer or a film author, it doesn't matter. Help each other out, that way we all succeed. The fire danced smoothly off her skin as I sat there soaked in the yellow haze, watching clouds chase shadows through vacant fields where children once played, for only in my dreams do rooms seem to expand. Stretching delicately through long winters, incubating soft, delirious cries of the wild, learning to whisper through lust as I pray to the Lord every night. God, you have to know, man, you have to tell me that the heart I possess is enough. As here I am, stuck in this traffic jam, idling my time, my money in this car, and well, honestly, so far I'm paying 8.09.4 per gallon just to sit in this here traffic jam. And when I begin to close my eyes, when I begin, when I, when, when, when I begin to close my eyes. I begin to see how Coltrane's infinite chant cleanses everything. As I'm looking over my shoulder, I'm looking around every 19th corner for the correct answer. Yet surprised when I wake in the morning and see a brand new woman snug deep under my covers. I'm trying to think to myself, Greg, man, Greg, who she was. Now key snapped in half, windows nailed at the latch, all the doors and all the windows nailed in at the hatch. No way to get out as I'm looking around every corner still and I can't be surprised when I look for the answer. Yet when I stood up, when I arose, I became a victim of a drive-by shooting in the woods, and that's when words repelled against your skin so goddamn fast and special in a one minute. Now this instant, I need my fa my rapid it, my rapid refund and send a paycheck. And when I recover, see when I recover, I discover the movement of the trees as I'm able to meditate with ease, and I reach for my ladder, and I used to take a hit and. <laughs> Ooh, yes, yes, I must admit that that was influential. But it wasn't nearly as influential as Coltrane's infinite musical. As here I am. I'm just idling my life away, man. Stuck in this here traffic jam. That's that piece. Thank you so much. I, I'm, wow, I, you made a dream become reality for me. Thank you.